for North Florida, things aren't great. They're about to get worse. We're playing the number eight team in the country, Oklahoma. We're playing at home, so that counts for something. Give you guys an update on some of our top prospects right here. We are still tracking Sonny Sanders, that five-star athlete right now. We're only 585 points behind. If you want to know how we're trending for that, we're plus 300. So we're looking pretty good. Marlon Anthony is still really our main guy right now. We have a scholarship offer out to him. We are 1,200 points ahead of everyone else, and we're trending positively. So that's great. Ron Thurston, another one of our top guys. But we have 500 max points on him, and we're trending down a little bit. West Virginia is leapfrogging us, and they're doing pretty well. So we got to hope that we can get a visit on schedule for this guy soon and lock him in. One of our other top recruits here again, Tavarius Miller. This guy we have scheduled for week number seven. He's coming up pretty soon now, and we're still losing a little bit of track against Rutgers. So a lot of the top guys are going after. We're losing a little bit on, but I think if we can win a game soon, that'll help. We also, again, now have six total visits scheduled to various Miller, which you guys just saw in week seven. You have Damian Carter in week seven, a corner, another corner in Brigham Billings. Uh, and also, excuse me, in week 13, you have Joe Taylor in week number eight. And we're starting to move up a little bit for him right now. He's locking in his top couple of schools. Jimmy Harris, the defensive end in week number eight. We're pretty much blowing everyone out of the water. And Brandon Anderson, a guy who we're doing well with, but UCF is creeping on up. And while our head coach, Mervyn McMurvin, does not have any upgrades available, our defensive and offensive coordinators definitely do. So, an upgrade road close, which your defensive players gain, plus one block shedding for a game. We already have essentially upgraded charge, which would give us now plus two power moves and plus two finesse moves, or plus two injury and 10% increased stamina. I think we're going to try out the block shedding, which is I want to see how that really impacts us. And then the offensive side of things... Uh, we essentially have already upgraded up tempo, which gives us plus two to injury and 10% increase in stamina for games. But I think ball security would be kind of nice. Plus one for carrying in a game. Let's give it a shot. I doubt really upgrade that much, but I just want to unlock the next level from here on out pretty soon. I'm going to give you a preview of this matchup. Kirk Herbstreit says we basically have no chance. He's 100% picking Oklahoma. They are supposed to blow us out of the water. Surprise, surprise. My goal is to get double digit points again. It's been a while. For reference, we lost 10 to 23 against Arizona State. We got blown out and things got really bad against LSU, playing at LSU. We played at Penn State, the number two team in the country. We held them under 50. Swoop. And then now we face Oklahoma, but we're playing at our house, which is, who knows. But we play at Rice next week, who is 0-4. Then it's UTEP, Western Kentucky, MTSU, ODU, FIU, FAU, and Marshall. I feel like there's three wins in there. Or two. Or one. Maybe. So here we go. It's North Florida. Swoop. It's Oklahoma. Nobody cares about the Sooners. Get him up out of here. Upset coming. Not really. Hey, look. Listen. It's raining. This is the perfect storm. No pun intended. I'm about to swoop all over this team. Are you running? Our field tackled you. Swoop. Listen, though, I need the best slogans for North Florida in the comments down below. If you got a great one, I'll shout you out, but I need the best, okay? If you like one that you see, give it a thumbs up. I'm going to be honest. They're doing the hurry-up offense nonstop, and it kind of scares me. I feel like an option is coming. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. We are the best. Swoop. Fly, swoop. Fly, swoop. Fly. What? It's the rain. I don't genuinely think I've seen a punt formation from our team ever. <laughs> like, have we ever forced a team to punt? It was the first time for everything. Six yard return. Let's go. Hey, just as a heads up, we're rocking our alternate uniforms. They look kind of spiffy if you ask me. All right, Osborne with the yard. Oh, let's go. One yard at a time. Real talk though, I definitely plan on rocking the alternate uniforms as we can. I want to, you know, mix it up a little bit. Hello. Okay, then. All right. Sit down, young man. Things were going so good. I was feeling so positive about life and everything. Expose him. Spencer Rattler, we're coming for you. Look, I'm hoping we can get a W and show Spencer Rattler he should have played basketball and not football for Oklahoma, okay? Oh, they got a guy in some crazy motion. Oh, Lord Jesus. Help. Hello? Fumble. Our guys, like, tackle so poorly that... They don't even like get hurt enough to fumble. Like that's what that's what's happening right now. I'm playing the defensive line right now. I'm gonna watch Brooks. He scares me. No, watch Rattler. Just help. All right, we gotta run a QB spy basically every time because Spencer Rattler's running like 90% of the time at the moment. 
Oh, Lord Jesus. Okay, buddy. Okay. Okay. Look, I'm just going to be honest. We can definitely score with Oklahoma. You don't believe me? Another one. Hello? Douglas, great name. It's only the first quarter halfway through. That's it. Hello? Hey, look, man, y'all not going to come into North Florida and do this to us without paying us a million dollars. Please help. Osborne, run them over. Let's go. Honestly, the run game is our best bet right now. We got to use that a lot. You guys might notice I, I changed the camera up, so now you can see everything. The downs and distance, you can score. You can see a little bit now, okay? Is this camera better? Let me know in the comments. Tell me. You complained a lot, so tell me. I honestly can't front. Osborne just, he's playing different right now. Bro, how does he know? How? I don't want to shock anybody, but if he scored a touchdown here, they, we cut the lead in half. Quick math. Look at Osborne, player of the game already. Literally player of the game already right now. Okay, bro, give the ball to someone other than Osborne. No. Why? That man has literally carried us. Literally. 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 I know he's about to get tired, though, so I'm trying to, like, pump the brakes on. Give him the ball, like, nonstop. Yeah, he literally just got tired. Bro, you have no hands. Where are they? That guy literally has the worst hands of all time. I can't believe it. I mean, I can. <laughs> That's what you get. We can't kick a field goal this far, can we? Probably not. All right, Coach Mervin McMurvin says go for it, because our kicker... We got cataracts, you can't see this far. So, here we are. Oh my God. Oh, baby Gronk. Man, there's no speed, but good Lord, can he catch? Thank you. Imagine we turned our season around, baby Gronk had 9,000 yards and he won the Heisman. Imagine, just think about it for a second. Nope. Oh my God. Inception can't. can't. Ah, catch it. I'm not raging. I'm just sad. Bro, no one on my team can catch. This is the saddest story that's ever been told. Another one. I swear I saw him. Great tackle, Douglas. Our leading tackler. An offensive lineman. The game, bro, you had such and such wide open. Shh. Oh, holy the refrigerator. Let's go. I know it's kind of weird to say because we've already given up two touchdowns, but like defensively, we're playing better today. You know, it's, we're just playing better. Suppose him. I want somebody to fumble so we can recover it. But all you do is throw an interception. Got enough of your sass. Oh, my God. That's the closest we've ever come to an interception. Two points in one game. You know, remember that time they faked the field goal? I mean, a punt. I'm, I'm chilling. I'm afraid of that every time. Okay, they're actually punting it. Yo, we might get more than six yards in this return. Let's run. Just kidding. We got six yards again. All right. First down. Don't mess us up. Don't say it. What are you typing right now? Better be positive. Encouragement. This isn't going to work either, is it? You know what, honestly, seventh best play we fan today. This offensive line, like, just really doesn't block, though. <laughs> There's, like, no blocking on the offensive line. It's pretty bad. I want to say I didn't mean to throw it there, but I did. He got the ball again. Imagine that. Four minutes left here in the first half. <gasps> oh, my God. The first time it's ever happened. Bowman. Bowman. Bowman put a statue of that young man in front of the entire university. Ray Bowman, the greatest defensive player of all time. We cut the lead in half. Technically, we got to make an extra point. We've cut the lead in half. Dre Bowman retires jersey. No one will ever wear the number 37 again in the history of this university. Never again. I don't want to, you know. 
Jinx ain't thing, but Spencer Rattler seems a little rattled if you ask me. Mm. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Swoop! I just drooled. I haven't been this excited since Bojangles was put an establishment in my old hometown of Harrisburg, Virginia, and I waited 45 minutes to drive through just to place my order, and I ordered forty dollars of chicken, and it was worth it. Yeah. Hey, buddy, just wait a darn second. This defense is playing lights out. I'm retiring Greer's number. Don't even know what it is. I'm retiring Bowman's number. I think it's 37. Spencer Rattler is rattled. Let's make, can we tackle? Okay, things are going bad again. This is the most points we've ever scored in our entire career. I'm blown away. North Florida out here, baby. Tackle him. No, 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 no. Ta Hello? Is that Terry Tate, the office linebacker? Yo, they really have a receiver named Rambo. That's his name? Your God? Oh, hey, you messing up now. Like, I don't know if we score another touchdown ever again offensively, but yo, defensively, we got a chance. We got people making plays right now. Oh my God. Oh no. Gotta make a play here. No, nah, I'm actually having. I was trying to have Coley or do a uh, QB spy, but it didn't work out. They're running a pretty heavy hurry up offense on us right now, which kind of scares me. Yo, 23, go guard him. Please, that's Rambo. <gasps> We almost had a sack. We almost had a sack. Honestly, I feel like I feel like blitzing is the move because he's been rattled so much today. Hello? Bruh. What is what is happening? Why is he crawling on the ground? We're not alligators. We swoop, we fly. That was <laughs> bro. The rain is making everything go crazy for them, and I love it. Right, they're trying to take a field goal right now. Come on, Rain, help us out right now. Please help me, Tom Cruise. Please. Miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it. That's good. Okay. We're down three. We're almost at halftime. This never happens right now. What I would like to do is put together solid offensive effort here. You know, a field goal, even to tie it up at halftime and make it interesting. ESPN will be. That is going to be. I'm, I'm done. Atari, I'm shutting the game off. You're out of here. You're out of here. Can you revoke someone's scholarship? Asking for a friend. I can't believe that. All I wanted was a good drive. You know? Spencer Rattler gets sacked! Hey, hey, Stoops, you nervous, huh? I don't think Bob Stoops is actually the coach anymore, isn't it? Like, Lincoln Riley? Is that who it is? It's somebody like that, but in this game, I think it's Bob Stoops. Ooh, I want the pick! I just Googled who the head coach of. Oklahoma is it's Lincoln Riley. He makes a lot of money. Jealous. Get there. Oh, no, that's not a first down. Fourth and two. Fourth and two. What y'all doing? What are the chances they fake a field goal on me right now? Never know. What if I caught field goal like off the goalpost? Right, that was good. Okay. All right, we're down six. Atari's out of the game. Maybe we got a chance. I really, really want Atari to be good. He's a freshman and we can grow with him. I mean, he's a redshirt freshman, but I wanted him to be good, but well, he's just been so bad. So is Jakari. Okay, this is going bad. I think after this game, I'm going to recruit even more quarterbacks. You never know. You never know. I like that. Okay, Weaver, I'll take the four yards. If we got four yards every single play, that equals a first down. Every time. Wait, what happened to my guy? Yeah, yeah, we'll take that. Another one. All right. Someone in the episode a couple episodes ago said, if I had a nickel for every interception you threw, I'd have seven nickels. You might have more this episode. Okay. Nope. Things aren't going good. How are you feeling, good game, bro? Bad. Okay, Rambo caught the ball. We tackled him. Successful. Just for the record, that guy's name is Charleston Rambo. I don't feel like Charleston's a good first name when your last name's Rambo. You gotta have something crazy like danger or attack or tackle him. Ooh. 
Revoke everyone's scholarship. 43 seconds left in a dream. What? I really got a team of like noodle alarms out here. This is kind of wild. Oh, whoa, what a throw. Hold on, buddy. Okay. Yo, I know my boy Jakari had an arm like that. Hmm. Hmm. Ain't nobody know he had an arm like that. I didn't even know he had an arm like that. Unreal. Okay. Not looking good so far. Y'all just not gonna block him? We just, we just not gonna block him? Okay, we got third and ten and just, it's not looking good. I don't want to talk about it. This is 100% a punt play. Another one. That's uh, six turnovers, so those of you counting at home. So with two seconds left here in the first half, they're going to line up for a field goal. Everything hurts. Yo, we had this game. We were locked in. We were locked in. We, it was tied up. It was tied up. It no longer is tied up. So going at halftime, it is 30 to 14. We are who we thought we were. Trash. Things were going kind of well when I ran the football with our guy, Mr. Lynn Osborne. And then since we stopped doing that, it just went kind of down. Oh my God, look at the, look at the lanes. I mean, that was really one lane, but I'm still six yards. I mean, look, y'all already know we don't really get first downs like that or big yards. So the fact that we almost can get a first down here, Kind of incredible, and I'm down for third and inches. All right, we got third and inches. I'm switching sides of the play. I feel pretty good about this. Got to get the first down. No chance we don't get this. Y'all, that buck sweep has moved yard after yard for us. I'm taking it. 43 yards and seven rushes. Average is 6.1 yards per carry against Oklahoma's defense. That's honestly incredible. And then here comes Whitmore. Yeah, three yards. That's okay. Wild thing is, Whitmore looks like he would be faster, but he's not. Thanks, Ryan, picking that off. Thank you. You know what? If I just ran the ball every time, I'd probably have a first down, but it's boring. We don't do that here, okay? We're North Florida. We make plays happen. Conception, just run away because you're not going to catch anything. You never know if we're going to catch it or not. We call one. My quarterback is three for 10 on passing. That's kind of Hall of Fame status if you're in Major League Baseball. We're playing college football here, so that's not without how that works. Oh my God, another one. McDowell caught one and held on to it. What is happening? Hey, real talk before I mess this one up, I'm gonna go ahead and run that football back. Cause uh, you know, you know, I know I'm probably gonna throw a pick. So I gotta make sure we get a run or two in there. I feel like they're gonna stop this play. So let's, uh, let's just run a different one. Cause I feel like they were, they were queued up to stop that one. They're probably gonna, look, he's, he's plugging the gap. How does he know? He's psychic, I'm not running there. Just kidding, it's Whitmore, no wonder. All right, here we are. I don't like it. Well, hey, 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 hold on. We going for it. We going for it. Y'all think I'm going to trust my kicker to go down here and put some points up on the board? We've already scored a career high. Osborne, you're the best. You're the best. You're the best. Way to run it. All right, feeling pretty good now. First and 10. Yo, Concepcion catching passes now? Okay. I'm gonna be honest. I don't really think he caught that one. But I'm not gonna say anything because I don't really want that overturned. We got a chance to get an offensive touchdown. Those don't happen very often here at North Florida University. University of North Florida. I don't know which one it is, honestly. Neither do you. I can't put into words how nervous I am right now. Catch the ball. I I can't front. I thought that was a touchdown. I thought it was a touchdown. It was not. I was incorrect. I hate everything right now. We're going for it. This is the biggest play in our university's history. Block your butts off. Oh, didn't block no one. 
Yeah, I'm not going for I'm blitzing everybody. Look at the play. Blitzing everyone. Yep, yeah, sir. Be blitzing. I just <laughs> I can feel a 97 yard touchdown coming. Blitzing. I'm blitzing the farm again. We got a couple people hanging back, but we're blitzing the farm. All right, Spencer Rattler. Oh my god, if it was Spencer holding on, I had the safety. We were so close. Hey, real talk, we're running the exact same play. That worked out pretty well. Because if they got a punt, we might be able to block a punt. That might be a first. No, 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 no. Stop him. Okay, there we go. They're not going to be able to get it blocked, but they're going to kick a punt now. Yeah, blocking this wouldn't work because they have plenty of room to punt this one. We're going to try and get a six yard return again. All right. Yo, we're going to have. Oh my god, we're going to be on the right side of the 50. Yeah. Oh! Little razzle dazzle, doubled our punt return average. Let's go. If you can't tell, we're putting things together, okay? We don't have a lot. What we do have, we value and we cherish it. Here at this university. Oh my God. Osborne's a stud. Give him the Heisman. Is that an owl? A Seahawk? I just learned an Osprey is apparently a Seahawk. Kinda. Maybe. This is honestly the first time in team history that we've entered the fourth quarter, not out of the game 100%. That's kind of a wild thing to think about. Oh my God, Osborne out here. <sighs> Give him the Heisman. That's the best run in team history. We're gonna relive it right here. Wow, 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 wow. First and goal and get the lead to single digits if my math is correct. I hope it is. I don't wanna do any more math though. It's been a long day. Osborne, okay, look, we got a yard or so. This is our opportunity to get a touchdown, though. If they start doing that heavy formation, we're kind of screwed. This is it. Let's go. Lynn Osborne, his second, I think, rushing touchdown of the season. I think. We'll take that. Cut the lead to single digits. Assuming the extra point goes in. We're not out of it yet. All right, coach says he wants to go for two. So it's probably going to be double digits. I don't assume we're going to get a conversion here, but you never know. You never know. Uh, I'm going to put Weaver or McDowell there. Weaver there. Okay. Nope. Uh, that was so close, but we're still within two scores. All we need to do technically is just get two stops and two scores. It's not a big deal. We've done it all the time. Getting to overtime even would be a heck of a challenge or a commitment thing. Buddy, we killed him, but he dropped it. I'm here for it. I'm here for he's not had a good game at all. We actually have more yards in Oklahoma. Oh my God. This is after all the pain we've been through this season. This is finally something good. Oh, no, 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 make him fumble. A fumble here would be so big, please. Generally, a fumble is what we need, though, because in this area, getting a ball would be huge. Stop him, stop him. There we go. There we go. That's a punt. Hopefully that's probably a punt. Maybe a punt. Hopefully a punt, not a fake. All right, they're lining up for a few. I mean, for a punt, not a field goal. They probably make it. We're going to assume it's a fake. I don't trust them. The real punt. Oh my God. Turn it. That you know what? That's not really our forte, but we got a long way to go. The biggest problem we have is that our office is predicated on running the football. We can't really do that right now. We got to do a lot of passing. Which is not our forte, if you haven't been paying attention. Bruh. Okay, then. Honestly, I probably should have just ran it. That would have been better for us. Booker on that late release. M right there. Yeah, yeah I like this. Got he. Okay, then. All right. I'm not going to lie. Jakari Martinez is a big dude. He's a big quarterback. He looks like Jared Lorenzo back there. Another one. You know what? Hello? What is happening? Seven turnovers. Barring something crazy, we've lost this game. But never say never. Swoop! There we go. There we go. Solid tackle. Back out here. Definitely blitzing again. I feel like an option is coming up. Oh, they're wasting clock. This this could be bad now. I'm gonna man align. A base align. That's. I need that safety to get over there. I'm scared about that. 
Alright, they're in single digits. They're gonna waste a lot of clock here. Let's play it smart. Definitely a run coming up. Just a fumble is all I want. Let's call a timeout. It's a big play. If we stop them here, huge. If they don't run it and pass it and we intercept it, amazing. Oh, they're passing. We caught it with one hand. They threw an animation in. Let's watch this. They won't show it because they don't want us to know that it was fake. Look at it. Ah! You more. Mighty more for Power Rangers. Help. We got two minutes, 26 seconds on the clock to score 17 unanswered points. I left my guy wide open. Get out of bounds. I know the clock stops, but I want everyone to be healthy and fresh out here. You really can't leave a guy like more wide open. I just saw him and I'm like, I'd be crazy if I didn't throw it to him. Okay, then. Okay. All right, second and 10. A little play action. Another one. Get him, Griffith. We're setting records out here, none of which I'm proud of. Once again, we find ourselves with our backs against the wall. I believe, though. And we can do something. Here we go. A lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. Pressure makes diamonds. <gasps> Don't fumble. We just got the ball. Hey, look, that's a moral victory. We finally forced a turnover. What a hit, too. Beautiful. Real fumble. Real recovery. We out here. Swoop. It's a 97.3% chance we're giving the ball right back. But look, that's none of your business, okay? Let's go, Martinez. Stop him. Jesus Christ, that man is 300 pounds. Nine turnovers. Mile. Mm, this man's doing the hurdle. Not today, Demon. The major play right here. Second and goal. I don't want them to score ever again. What I tell you, we're stopping them. Get out of here, Spencer. Third and goal. Don't let them score 40. I mean, they can get 40, but no, not 41. Uh, oh, you done messed up now, eh, Aaron? Y'all ain't scoring 40. Recap of the stats of today's game. Nothing great happened. Four interceptions by Martinez. Three by Atari Joseph, who was somehow on fire. No, I would beg to differ. On the ground, we probably should have given the ball to Lynn Osborne. He was eight yards shy of getting 100, which would have been the first time in school history someone did that. Uh, he had one touchdown on the ground. Atari Joseph and Shikari Martinez, I'm revoking your scholarships. In the air, not a lot to be happy with, but Keenan McDowell, three for 26. Lynn Osborne, two for 25. Maybe Gronk. Not much Gronk today, but still. Passing game's trash. Running game's really good. Just nothing else is good. Eventually, we saw DeAndre Greer get a bunch of punt returns, which is great. He also got an interception. We also saw uh, Bowman get an interception. Both of those returned for a touchdown. Greatest plays in school history is done by a senior and a junior. I'm here for that. Losing is never easy, and it is always frustrating. But the fact that our team, North Florida, the Ospreys, we took the number eight team in the country to the fourth quarter, and we were still in contention. We lost by 17, but again, that is a top 10 team. Our biggest problem Turn the ball over. Nine turnovers is never going to be good whenever we'll you have an opportunity really to win a game. But the fact you can say this is the greatest game in the history of our school, I'm going to be honest, that's kind of depressing, but I'm here for it.